What's up, guys? Joe Kennedy here. I'm the CEO here at Vitality Science Solutions. Uh, today, I want to talk to you guys about one of our favorite, um, you know, medications that we're prescribing. We're getting a great result from it. Um, you know, everyone's happy. Um, you know, and that's our ultimate goal here is patient satisfaction, and we're able to obtain this with one of our favorite, this favorite product we use. Um, it's what we use uh, when stimulating growth hormone. Okay. So today what we're going to talk about is CJC1295 and ipamorelin. Our first slide, um, just to tell you a little bit about our office. Um, we're located in Palm Beach Gardens, Florida. You know, we specialize in anti-aging meds, medical weight loss, do a lot of IV therapies. We do have the ability to service all 50 states. So uh, we love for people, patients to come in, check out the office. You know, um, you know, patients feel more comfortable when they leave. We have a beautiful facility. We have an awesome staff. So uh, we definitely love it when guys can, or whoever can, you know, get into the office and check us out. Okay. All right, let's get into it. All right, today, here's some of the topics we're going to be talking about, okay? What is CJC-1295 Ipamorelin? Why we like it so much? Um, why should you take CJC-1295 uh, together? You know, it is two medications, so we're going to talk about the benefits of uh, taking them, okay? We're going to talk about the benefits of CJC-1295 Ipamorelin. Um, we're going to give you a little bit of a timeline, um, you know, once you start taking it, kind of as the results go. And we'll tell you some stuff, some things you need to know, uh, you know, before taking it, uh, you know, how to get signed up and, you know, how to be a patient, okay? All right, what is CJC-1295 Ipamorelin? CJC-1295 Ipamorelin, okay, is a combination of two peptides, all right? Again, pretty, uh, makes CJC-1295 Ipamorelin, all right? So, CJC-1295, okay, is a growth hormone releasing hormone that stimulates uh, one side of the pituitary, okay, one of the receptors in the pituitary to produce growth hormone. Ipamorelin, okay, mimics uh, the ghrelin, okay, so therefore it's going to bind to the ghrelin receptor site uh, in the pituitary, okay. So uh, again, it's a growth hormone secretagogue, so a little bit different than uh, the CJC, okay? Um, again, it's also gonna act on the pituitary to produce growth hormone. Um, you know, these uh, two combinations, you know, act together to increase growth hormone by, again, acting on those two different receptor sites in the pituitary, on the pituitary, okay? So, if you think about it, your pituitary's got two sides, it's stimulated by two different receptors, okay? So, that's why, uh, you know, we got these guys together, okay? Uh, we recommend, you know, it be taken at night before bed, okay, um, 90 minutes post your last meal, all right, and the reason we recommend that is because we're trying to mimic the body's natural response production of growth hormone. Your body's, uh, let's say, most robust produce of growth hormone is done at night in your first REM sleep, okay, so that's why we recommend taking it at night. All right. So again, we're mimicking the body's natural production. Everything we're trying to do here is we're trying to be as natural, bioidentical, however you want to call it as possible with our therapies. Okay. Why should you take CJC 1295 and Ipamorelin together? Okay. Oops. All right. So, because we want to maximize, we want to get the body's most growth hormone production, okay? We want to release it into your body, all right? So, those two peptides, again, act on both receptors to give you a huge, robust produce of growth hormone, okay? Um, you're, it's going to be released in your body in a safe, therapeutic, anti-aging benefit, you know? What's a, what most a lot of people call, you know, growth hormone the fountain of youth, all right? You know, we're really getting more so to the peptide side of it because, you know, HGH, one, is so damn expensive. Two, um, there's a lot of side effects with it. So, you know, that's why we're kind of mitigating over majority of all of our patients over to the growth hormone releasing hormones. <laughs> All right, benefits, CJC-1295, Ipamorelin, okay? Increased bone density. You know, as we get older, you know, our bones get brittle, okay? That's why older people are more prone to injuries, 
bone breaks, stuff like that. And it's a direct response from a decrease in growth hormone production. Cardiovascular system. Okay, guys, uh, I can attest to this myself. Uh, my first triathlon I did, I wanted to do a test. I wanted to go all natural and see how I placed, right? Finished top 10. Uh, my second uh, race, I actually um, started the CJC, the 12.95 with David Morellan, and I actually took first place. Um, one of the biggest things I noticed is my endless kind of seemed to work out. You know, there I didn't really actually hit that wall, which I'm sure some of you guys can attest to. You're in the gym and you just can't go anymore. One of the things you will notice is a tremendous cardiovascular output and increase, okay? Um, it's going to increase muscle mass, all right? Growth hormone, higher growth hormone levels is proven over and over and over again to correlate to more muscle mass on the body, okay? More muscle mass, higher metabolism, less body fat. All right, which gets us into this part is the ability to burn fat, all right? It really, 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 um, you know, it's kind of like when you were a kid and you were going through puberty, you know, your growth hormone levels were at its peak, which I'm sure every single person can attest to here is, is they were at their thinnest in life, all right? Increased growth hormone levels equals decreased body fat, guys, all right? Um, sex drive, you know, guys, sex is huge. Uh, it's, in, you know, I don't care what anybody says it's, it's a vital part of, you know, our health, our mood, everything, you know, um, you know, poor quality sex life can lead things like depression, you know, you're really feeling down and out. So, um, you know, one of the things you'll notice is a increase in sex drive. Okay. You know, also those feel good hormones there. Okay. Again, what we're doing is getting your body's levels back to optimal. Okay. Again, so what you'll notice is, is kind of the same thing you did as you were a younger kid. One of the other things you're going to notice is your recovery time, guys. This is going to be from injuries, workouts, whatever, okay? A higher growth hormone level means your cells in your body are growing, reproducing uh, at an accelerated rate, okay? As we get older, growth hormone levels drop, okay? Our cells, okay, go along with it. They're not recovering, they're not repairing, and they're not rejuvenating as fast as they were, okay? So one of the big things you'll notice is uh, workout recovery time, and also repairs from injuries and whatnot. It's going to strengthen the immune system. Um, yeah, you know, well, personally, what I can notice and I can attest to, um, you know, being on hormone replacement therapy, you know, having the CJC 1295 in uh, I don't get sick. You know, my body's not run down. Um, you know, again, that's because the improved sleep, um, and just the overall effects it has on the immune system. Okay. It is a tremendous benefit. Okay. When you are trying to maintain optimal health and that's achieved again by a strong immune system. Okay. Uh, one of the other things people notice the most is the improved cognition and memory. Um, you know, as we get older, we forget things, you know, we just don't feel that mental clarity, sharpness as we're used to, you know, um, that's typically, you know, kind of one of the first things you're going to notice on this is the improved cognition and memory functions. All right. So again, this is again, guys, it's just an improved overall benefit to the body. Okay, it's going to improve insulin sensitivity, therefore reducing triglycerides, all right? Okay, this effect alone, all right, is one of the reasons why we see such a reduction in body fat, okay? It's also huge for people with elevated, um, you know, triglycerides, you know, high blood sugars, let's just call that equal to high body fat. Here's kind of a little timeline we put together, uh, what you can expect, uh, you know, taking this medication, all right? You know, in your first week, you know, you're going to notice quality of sleep. I actually just got a text message uh, from a patient on it. Thank you so much. I haven't slept this good in 15 years, okay? Um, the sleep, guys, it's the biggest thing. You'll notice your dreams are vivid. You'll notice you're waking up refreshed. You're not, it's not that tossing and turning throughout the night, okay? You know, week two, you're going to start to notice your recovery time and your workouts has been cut down by almost half, okay? You know, I personally noticed um, 
not doing CJC 1295 versus doing it, you know, versus me on it, I'm able to get one more day of training in a week, you know, just so my body's not run down and beat up. Week three is going to be the mental clarity. You know, that's when the sharpness starts, the cognitive function, the memory increases, all that stuff. Week four, you're going to notice your skin is tightening up. This is what some of the, the female patients love the most, okay? Um, the skin, the elasticity it brings back, okay? That tightness, all right? Week six is really when the body composition starts, all right? You're going to really start to notice that waist shrinking. You're going to notice kind of you're a little bit tighter around the sleeves and the arms, you know, just that whole body recomposition, you know, getting you back to your ideal body composition, what you were in your youth, okay? Um, you know, this is what quick little timeline, like I said, of what to expect. All right, guys, um, you know, some things I kind of want to talk to you about, you know, CJC 1295 Ipamorelin should not be used while you're pregnant or breastfeeding. You know, um, definitely always tell your physician about all medication supplements, especially corticosteroids or any type of thyroid medications that you're currently taking. You know, um, some of the common side effects of CJC 1295 is basically nothing, but what we have seen in very, very rare cases, and the side effects are pretty manageable, is going to be injection site reactions, okay? Little redness, little swelling, um, you know, nothing crazy at all, guys. To be in all honest with you, I would say a mosquito bite's worse uh, than the side effects of CJC 1295 from all right, guys, again, um, it's Joe Kennedy here, Vitality Sciences. Uh, I dropped my personal email in there if you got any questions. Uh, I put the direct line to the office. Um, you can reach my secretary. She's my go-to. Um, helps me with everything, um, assisting, coordinating patients, whatnot. So, um, you know, you can give us a follow. Um, check out our website. It's got all the links to the social media. Um, it's www.vitality-sciences. Again, guys, we're located in Palm Beach Gardens, Florida. All right, I appreciate you taking the time to watch and I uh, hope to hear from you.